Okay, on the Chalupa lovers, welcome to this player got Tessa Rotenga Mikola Shaparenko, the 19 year old center, made this a 70 overall, so 3 star skimmers and 3 star weak foot, he is 5 foot 10, right footed with high high work rates. As we'll take a look at those initial physical and mental attributes, so 59 acceleration, 59 jumping, 58 sprint speed, pretty poor with that pace and jumping, 70 agility, then 71 balance, 65 stamina, and 50 strength. So not the best physically. Mentally, though, pretty good vision of the 71 mark. Then 72 reaction, 68 interception, 63 composure, 70 attack position, and 57 aggression. As we now flip over to see his initial tactical attributes. Uh, the short pass, clearly the best attribute from the start there with the 72 short pass. Then 66 ball control, 59 crossing, 67 dribbling, 64 finishing, 69 long pass, nice, 66 long shots, 67 marking, 66 slide tackle, and 64 stand tackle. As we'll now see that growth at the end of that first season here. Uh, and some pretty good improvements for sure with a plus 3 to his overall. And the balance up by 3 points. A plus 1 to Jody. Stamina up by 8 points though. Definitely stands out. And mentally attack position up by 3. Plus 1 to the aggression composer. Interceptions. Reactions. Also saw a little bit of improvements uh, to the pace there. So technically the dribbling up by 4 points. A uh, plus 4 also the finishing. Long pass up by 3 Plus for the long, the long shot, short pass, then the slide tackle and stand tackle up by five. So some good improvements in that first season, not the end of the second season, up to the 76 overall. So good improvement there physically. The balance and jumping up by two, a plus one acceleration, sprint speed up by three, stamina up by four, and a plus three to the strength. And mentally, interceptions up by three points, a plus two to the reactions and vision, and a plus one to the aggression and attack position. Now technically, OP finishing growth continuing there, now with a plus seven in this season. Dribbling up by four, ball control up by two, big plus seven to his long pass, long shots and short pass up by four, a plus three to his stand tackle there also. He's now up to 79 overall at age 22. He's growing pretty quickly. He's actually not too far away from his potential already with the stand up by four points, balance and jumping up by two, plus on the sprint speed and strength and mentally big growth interceptions as interceptions do grow a lot for center mids without training. And technically again, a plus seven to the finishing all the way up to the 82 there. Ball control, short pass, shot power, and stand tackle up by four points also. Dribbling, I believe, also grew quite a bit in that season. So now up to the 82 overall, age 23. Balance hitting the 80 mark. So he's actually going to feel pretty good on the ball with that balance at the least. Stamina looking a lot better. Mentally, interceptions hitting the 80 mark. Big growth to the reactions of vision there also. And now technically dribbling improving by 9. A plus 6 to the finishing. Long shots up by 4. Plus to the short pass and slide tackle. And the stand tackle up by 4 points to hit the 80 mark there. So we'll get into some gameplay highlights of him. And he was a very solid play. Look at his passing ability. A great ball switched right there in, in that space. I uh, really enjoyed his passing. He felt pretty good on the ball because of that. A decent agility and balance. Obviously not amazing. And then he ends up having some really good stand tackling ability as he saw in that highlight there this time again tracking back down that wing bodying at the player winning the ball uh with the stand tackle actually hit off of the player as well there so perfect uh stuff from him and this time getting involved in the build-up play and a very good pass there to grab an assist i loved that assist right there getting involved getting up a little bit higher up the pitch playing a perfectly weighted ball uh to get that assist so love to see that from him. this time tracking back again has that nice stamina and tackling ability and definitely showed right there but the catch up speed obviously this year it seems like and ends up with that amazing finishing because the finishing growth for center mids without training is very overpowered as you can see right there uh ends up with some pretty high finishing and doing a good job again getting those interceptions the passes weren't clean this time moving over winning the ball right there Good work from him in that midfield. So he was actually a very solid box-to-box -box center mid. And he grew very quickly without training. This time, pushing forward, playing another good through ball. Uh, they're also getting involved in the attack. So perfect box-to-box -box center mid, in my opinion. Not the best physical attributes, but I really enjoyed him nonetheless. So and ends up being 85 overall at age 24, hitting that potential. And the acceleration at 65, a little bit better than before. 73 agility, though, an 80 balance. So again, I thought he felt really good on the ball because of that. 65 jumping, 66 sprint speed, 87. And stamina, so tons of growth that stand without training. 56 strength, then mentally 80 attack position, 83 interceptions, 82 reactions, 80 vision, 68 composure, and 59 aggression. So, really good interceptions. Love the vision, also. Uh, good attack position, so really well run with that. Technically, course got that OP finishing growth, ending up being a 92 in that area. 81 ball control, 91 dribbling, 
83 long pass, 87 long shot, 70 marking, 86 short pass, 75 slide tackle, and 83 stand tackle. So really good uh, stand tackle ability there. Not too bad the slide tackle and marking pretty good being at the 70 mark there as well. Now take a look at his play information here. So you can take a look at his work rates, his height, and all that once again. He's 5'10", right footed with high, high work rates, 3-star weak foots, and 3-star skimmos. We'll see what specialties he ended up with. So the dribbler, engine, and clinical finisher specialties on him. So really good specialties right there. And you can see that playmaker for CPU AI only traits. Then uh, the individual growth of each attribute here now. So the finishing, obviously ridiculous growth per usual, up by 36. Short passing, not too bad, the plus 14. Dribbling, though, tons of improvement there, up by 24. Uh, the long pass up by 14, and the ball control up by 15. Acceleration up by 6. Sprint speed up by 8. Agility up by 3 points. A plus 10 to his reactions, and a plus 9 to his balance. The shot power up by 7. Jumping up by 6. Stamina improving by 22. Long shots up by 21 points. And mentally, I do like to see that mental growth. That looks really good. I just think that finishing growth is really overpowered. So maybe trade some of that finishing for maybe a little bit more to the pace or something next season would be nice or some other areas. But plus 15 to the interceptions, positioning up by 10, vision up by 9, composure up by 5, then defensively a plus 3 of the marking, stand tackle up by 19, and a plus 9 to his slide tackle. Then he is 81 as a winger, 82 as the center forward, 84 as the cam, 81 as the right mid, left mid, 79 as a wing back, and then 80 as a center defense mid. So really good in that uh, midfield. I like loved him as a center. We played him a little bit as a cam. I think he could be pretty good there also. Obviously Obviously not amazing physically, but very solid. He ends up being really good two-way midfielder with that tackling ability. He ends up with also interceptions, positioning, vision. Love to see that. Then ends up with some high stamina. Very good tactical attributes also with the finishing, dribbling, uh, passing, and ball control. So ends up being a very good player once he hits that potential. Might be with Chalupa lovers. I definitely recommend playing him as a, as a center mid or a cam. But yes, I love you all. Thank you all for tuning in. Hope you have like a great weekend yeah have a great weekend my people chalupa lovers uh, i really love and appreciate all your support lately hope you guys have a good one leave a like on the video if you haven't i love you all thank you for tuning in i'll be signing out now and i'll catch you guys later